to subscribe innovative ideas click on subscribe button and click on bell icon since this is the new generation smps it's having eight and four connectors only and uh, it is different of that uh, earlier model power supply which is having 24 pins and 4 pins 24 plus 4 pins and this is the latest generation this is our latest generation power supply it is of 8 points 8 connectors and 4 connectors so let us see so this is the power supply I have unscrewed and there are some more screws the switch is to reset while overloading so it is connected over here let us have a look over here if any part seems to be bursted or shorted oh, not at all so first of all let us check the fuse Oops, the fuse is not working. So, first of all, I will replace the fuse. Let us check the value. It is of 6.3 amperes, 250 volts. I am replacing with a new one. So this is the new fuse, I am applying over it. The fuse has been applied and uh, now let us check it in series that what happens. I am testing it on series as you can feel that the bulb is glowing I am connecting the series supply to the SMPS let us see what happens oh it is shorting it is shorting so let us check the part one by one that it is clear that the primary system is shorting because as we give the power supply in series manner to the primary it is shorting so there must be error in the primary circuit so this is the primary circuit and this is the secondary circuit so let us check one by one I have already connected the fuse these are the coils for boosting and uh, this is the capacitor and this is the bridge sometimes in and most of the times when the bridge is shorted this problem occurs so let us check the bridge basically it's a diode bridge and in diode bridge uh, the testing manner is that the cut portion pin is positive and this end is negative so let us check it
it is giving the perfect value so if it is short then multimeter will give a beep sound like this it is quite well and let us check another components let us go for the MOSFETs it is quite well this is also good and one two three four fourth one is here it is also quite well so let us go for the another part uh, friends in most of the branded systems uh, one varistor is also connected in the main supply section to protect the extra components connected so let us check that varistor also here is that it's a uh, it may be zov or mov and uh, let us check that varistor so it is connected over here So this is the barrister and uh, it is being covered so let us open its cover and let us check the value oh yeah it is burnt so as you are seeing it is burnt and the cause of the burning of this component is uh, over voltage so simply changing this let us see what happens and its value is 14471 14471 yeah i am having the same component it's a zob 14471 that is 14d471k now I am also applying it. Now let us check once again. The shorting has been removed or not. yes great now the shorting has been removed and let us check the output shorting has been removed and uh, in my as per my experience the power supply is now working fine and in my opinion power supply is working fine let us check it uh, uh, on the system because this new technology power supply will work when the load is given on it so let us apply it on the system simply just to connect on the motherboard and let us see the result Now I am connecting the main supply. 
yes yes it happened and uh, the power supply is working quite well and let us switch on the system yes it is working fine good and let us check the display of the system whether it is coming or not let us checking it by restarting the PC yes display is coming good now I will connect all the remaining components hard drive DVD writer etc so friends this was the video for repairing the SMPS if the primary uh, circuit is not working fine you can check uh, this type I have shown in the video so friends keep innovating and if you like this video please do like and share with your friends and if till date you you have not subscribed my channel then please do subscribe innovative ideas for more videos thanks for watching thank you to subscribe innovative ideas click on subscribe button and click on bell icon